Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of our 7 Days to Die series. Today, we have a wolf just behind that rock over there. I don't know if you saw him kind of dip behind, but yesterday we did a little bit of questing, did a little bit of everything really, and I decided that I would try to take on that house and that was a terrible idea. There is a feral white up at the top and I could not kill him, so I ran. The sensible solution. I want to get that dog. Let's see if I can lure him over here. Come here, puppy. I don't have... I'm gonna have to just grab you from here and then run, run, run real fast. Hey, puppy. Hey, puppy. Yep, you got big glowing eyes. I don't know if you're faster than I am or not. This could be the end of me. Right, where are you going? Okay. Big puppy. Cannot get in through here. Let's do a little bit of wacky wacky smacky. And stab you in the face. Jesus, criminally that took forever. Whew. Okay. At least I know this base works for the most part. I did do a little bit of finishing up here. Oh, that's gonna bug me. I'm gonna have to fix that. I was wondering why <laughs> I was short one. Um, I put these hatches in so that I could take care of birds. If they happen to come by, I can just open this up and then they will they should pathfind to here and then I should be able to take them out there. But other than that, I just finished up the ceiling. Let's go ahead and take care of that block. Let's get, grab some frames here. That's probably enough. I also, I, I found a workbench last episode, or a workbench schematic, and I went ahead and I made that over the course of the night, and, um, yeah, I didn't, I looted it, but I didn't really, it was, wasn't anything super exciting, so I didn't feel like showing it, um, but I think I want to get my revenge on that house. I feel like I can sneakily put a hatch down hopefully and maybe be able to take on that guy but I'm not 100% sure and I don't think his I, I think his health reset too let's go ahead and let's actually put these frames down because I need let's see one two three one two so it's just right down here and here so let's go ahead and get that workbench put in I'm gonna frame this down just because I don't I'm going to replace this with frames anyway, and I don't want this to collapse, just on the off chance that it does, I don't want it to happen. Let's do this real quick, and then we'll get our workbench in here nice and neat, and then, ah, oh, beautiful. I don't know what I can craft here. What weapons can I make? Nothing. I can make a steel spear, and I can also make a machete, but I need, I don't have enough parts for that. Do I have steel spear parts? I have four. <laughs> of course I have four when I need five. Um, okay, that's fine. As long as I have it, that's okay. Let's go ahead and put this back. Uh, let's go ahead and get this stuff all put away. Oh, that didn't go in there. Okay, that's fine. Um, this stuff can all go in there. Why did I? I must have accidentally thrown that in um, that chest instead of here. But that's okay. Let's get my food in here. And we're actually doing pretty good on meat. I can make a couple of bacon and eggs. Actually, let's do that real quick. Because that only takes like 30 seconds or so. Yeah, 31 seconds is all that takes. So I'm going to make some of those. And then I have a meat stew left. I bought some charred meat and boiled eggs off of the trader. In fact, I should probably just eat these. Because that way I can hold on to the bacon and eggs. And not have to have a whole bunch of food in my inventory. But, yeah, I am definitely wanting to go take on that feral white because I wimped out real hard <laughs> when I saw him. And uh, I don't want to have that sort of legacy. I have an ego to keep up. And I, that's probably going to be the death of me, honestly. But, you know, it's okay. So let's go ahead and let's go straight into it. I'm just going to rush through the top because that's where I left off. And then, you know what, let's bring my motorcycle just in case I have to jump off and ride out. Because I don't know for sure if the whites outrun me. Especially a feral. 
it would be one thing if it was just a normal white, because then he'd just be walking, but no, of course he has to be a feral. Let's park that right out here. Uh, I have an extra glass jar on me that I don't really want, but that's okay. Let's preemptively make a hatch here. I should have brought some iron with me, actually. Is there any iron out here that I can use just to scrap or just to get that thing? You know, I does this give any iron? It gives five. That's not a lot. Poopy. I could just go back. It's right here. My base is literally right here. I don't know what I'm complaining about for. So let's preemptively sneaky sneak. And let's... Oh, I didn't bring my stone axe. Let me just make one real quick. It's not a big deal. I think that's about... That's all I need, right? Yeah. Okay, let's go back up real quick. I should just frame up, but it's okay. Not a huge deal. Definitely. Okay. I heard something. Did I just wake something up? Is it going to be coming at me now? Please tell me no. What did I just hear? Oh, I don't want to wimp out twice and... Such a short amount of time. Okay. Not over here. Well, let's just do this. I don't have the iron hatch, but that's okay. Because this should hold for a little bit. Where was he? I don't know for sure. He's probably just up on the top here. Yeah, there he is. Can I wake him up? Hey, buddy. Wakey, wakey. Wake up. Hey, whitey boy. Yep, yep. Come on. Round two. Yeah, come here. Come on. Come on, buddy. Oh, boy. Yep. I'm not pansying out. Hey, nope. Ow! 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 Extendo arms, buddy! What in the world? Oh, he's almost broken that. Okay. Oh, did I get him? <sighs> okay, that's fine. Let me teabag you just to prove my point. Oh, boy! Okay. My heart's still actually pounding from that, even though he's dead. Anybody else in here? There's probably somebody in this door. Oh, no, this leads outside. Bird? No. Watch, that'll be how I go. I 1v1 this feral white, no problem, and then a bird just comes and ends me. Oh. <sighs> You know what I want to 
kind of do. I kind of want to go back home and make a helmet light mod. Um, let me pillar up. Do I have any of the frames with me? I don't think I do. Let's make like five. And let's... I think I can just go up. There we go. Oh, that's... That's all right. Okay. I need to go down there, but I'm going to drop some stuff off on my bike real quick since I already made the frames to pillar back up. So I'll meet you down there. Okay. Just got the lab assistant here, and I think there's... Yeah. There's a couple of you. Let's aggro one of you. Just take... Come on. Okay. One down. Just gotta get the other one. Okay, perfect. And now I think it's just a couple more areas here, and then there's the big loot. I don't I think I'm safe until I get down there, and then that room has a ton of zombies in it. And then I'm pretty sure I can just side run. Oh no, I think there's some zombies in there. But I wanna go up here. If I hug this wall, I shouldn't fall. And then let's get the shamway box because I need food still. Ah, three cans of sham. I will take that. I am a sucker for sham. Now let's go in here real sneaky sneaky like. Or maybe there's not anybody in here. Okay, there is. Lady. Oh no, you still saw me? Don't run, please. Thank you. I don't know how sneaky I'll be able to be with these guys. Come on. Oh, there's one right at the base of the stairs. Nope, you woke up. That's okay, I popped your head anyway. Okay, there's one right there. Hasn't woke up. Okay. I think I can reach that guy from here. Yes. Okay, I've got one more guy over here, I think. Okay. Let's sneak down. Be real, real quiet. I don't think there's anybody behind here. Another medical pile. Let's just double check. Okay, yeah, we're good. I don't really feel like getting the medical pile. I didn't switch out my... That sucks. That's okay. Okay, now I think all we need to do is go into that big room. Oh boy, who did I wake up? Okay. That's fine. You can just stop doing... Can you, like... What are you doing? Ugh. Okay. I think this room is clear. Oh, all of these guys are loading in right now, and it's freaking out my game. Okay, I'm probably going to have to wake everybody up. Was that a white? Or was that- Oh my gosh. Okay, let's just let him blow up. Now how many did he break? Or how many did he kill? Is that a feral or is that just a regular one? I can't tell. That's fine. Popped your head. Okay, you're dead. How many others are there? What is up with like all the cops and stuff like that? Cops, whites. Let's run in. No? Hello? Hello? Okay, I guess. Oh, what in the world? That, like, flipped my camera all the way around. Do you see that? Holy cow. I super panicked there. Okay, buddy. Alright, is that... 
Are there any more that might like fall on me? No, okay. Let's take care of these guys then. Let's, okay. I might anger both of these at once. Nope. Just don't start running at me. Please. Okay. Oh, you're just gonna start running at me. Okay. Whew. Let's take out this guy here. That's a feral. I have to be careful not to anger her. Okay. What? Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. That's fine. I'll just let you bleed. You're gonna run. That's okay. I'm gonna stand right here. Let you bleed out. And we should be good. Ooh. A cop and a feral white. I don't want to know what this Horde Knight's going to look like. I just can't believe these guys didn't wake up. Even still, this lady isn't awake. There she goes. Come on, lady. Hurry up. Are you just... Oh my gosh. Come on, lady. No, I can't. Oh. Let me hit you. Stop doing that with your head. Will you now will you Well, since she's being such a pain in the butt, I will just meet you back if she either kills me or I have the hardened chest unlocked. Alright, looter goggles on. Let's start with the shamway box. Uh, more sh sham sandwiches on it. If I'm that hungry, I will, but that's okay. Check the weapons bag. Another sledgehammer. That one's a little bit better. Let's see. Check the ammo pile. And the big boy. I will take that. And... Uh, I wish it would have been light armor, but that's okay. Let's just uh, take this here, swap it out, and then let's just throw that on my... Uh, let's throw it on my pickaxe for now. And then let's grab that, and we should be good to head out of here. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. There is a wandering horde outside. Uh, let's break this one. I should be able to sneak right out. Let's just not look. There's somebody outside. I made somebody angry. They're probably inside, actually. I wonder. It's okay. I'm going to drop the stuff off back at home. And then we'll pick up a quest from the trader here. And see if we can't get a little bit more stuff done. So all of his quests are, like, stupid far except for like two and it's a fetch i'm gonna take the buried supplies then i think i'm gonna head to jen and see what she's got because i didn't actually check her post restock uh let's swap my actual quest i've found a ton of challenges so that is something that we'll probably do eventually but they're the ones that like i mean kill bears kill stags it's not like actually going out and doing stuff um how far away is this it's not too far. But, oh, I did also, the past couple of days were, they felt like they were dragging on a little bit. So I did lower the 24-hour cycle to 90 minutes. And I feel like that'll be a better, better um, median, I guess. Because, yeah, the, stop opening my Steam menu. I'm not even hitting shift. Ugh. Okay, I hope to God this isn't under the road, but but yeah, I set it to 90 minutes. That'll hopefully make the nights not drag on quite as bad because I kind of felt like I was absolutely doing nothing at night, even though I was digging out some of the stuff in my base. 
But um, I'm going to dig this out here. And hopefully it's not under the road because then I'll get pinched and I don't want to, that to happen. But I will catch you back probably when I am at Trader Jen. I'll make the am I at Jen? Yes. Did I forget my Dukes at home? Yes. <laughs> if she has anything super awesome, then I'll go for it. But, uh, I mean... Oh, she has a cigar. Holy cow, that's expensive. But that's a cigar, though. Um, That's a lucky litter book, too. Okay, what jobs do you have? Um, yeah, let's take this. And maybe, maybe from the stuff that I get from that, I'll be able to afford that cigar. Uh, yep, that was the shopping cart. That's okay. Where's that? Um, I never turned in the quest for that, but that's okay. Where? There we go. Hi, buddy. Maybe you'll drop me a nice... It's... Yeah, what is up with that stagger? Is it just with the big biker man that I'm just... My camera's shaking violently for? Cause that's nuts. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and go over here. I'm going to finish up. I'm just going to do this quest. It's probably not going to be super bad. Unless I get a another freaking feral white. Then I'll probably be in some trouble. But I'm going to go ahead and just start it. It And then um, if anything super interesting happens, I'll pop back in. So I'll be right back. I'm getting a weird glitch. Okay, I guess there's an empty bookcase here somewhere that I didn't know about, and there's totally a to- Ugh. That toilet knife <laughs> is frustrating. Um, is there anybody else in here, in this floor? No, it doesn't look like an- Yes, there is somebody out here, okay. Oh, I bet it was that bookshelf then. I wonder. Oh, let's swap to my nerdy glasses quick. Yeah, is this... Aha! I see. Okay. Well, that was weird. Okay, let's just make sure you don't get us. Okay. I'm gonna keep on uh, whacking at this quest here, and I'll meet you in a bit. I have never seen this painting before. That looks nice. Oh, there's nothing behind it, though. I still haven't cleared this area, which is nuts. And I I think I've been, like, I feel like I'm almost at the end of it. I swear there's going to be a dog. There's just more and more to this house. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. I think there's a zombie plinging, pinging at the front door. I don't want him to come surprise me. Hello? I could have sworn I heard somebody out here. Now I, I keep seeing these kennels and everything like that, so I swear in my life that I'm going to have to fight a dog at some point, and I'm not ready for it. Ugh. Okay. Well, I'm going to keep going here. I'll meet you in just a second. Okay, that's clear. There was no dog. A whole bunch of kennels, but absolutely no dog. <laughs> I was super on edge for no reason. There is a gun safe here, which is fantastic. Is that a landmine? No. Okay, let's go ahead. I can probably end up lockpicking this, so let's take a look here. I have a few lockpicks. If not, I can always just break through it. It's not a huge deal. I just got the book to give me 10% damage to saves. How many do I have? I have 8, so... Yeah, we should be plenty fine here. Um, hopefully this will give me enough dukes to be able to buy that cigar. I have a lot of stuff that I can sell. Okay, that's unlocked. Let's start with the little stuff here. Let's just grab these cabinets. Never know when there's something semi-useful in these. I already grabbed that shelf. And then Godwater. Got a thing of Godwater. Awesome. And then a couple of iron tools. Ooh, a level 4 iron sledge. A bar brawler book. 
I will grab that. And, oh, nice. Iron Spear. Okay, that's awesome. Alright, that's time for me to go back to Jen here. And this should get me plenty of dukes, so I should be fine. So I'm going to make my way over there, and I'll meet you in a second. Alright, Jen. Uh, what sells for more? The crossbow does. Let's go ahead and sell all of this stuff here. Um, I can sell that stuff. I'll keep the sledge. Oh, that's 2,000 dukes. That's all I need. Let's go ahead and get that cigar. That's perfect. Um, anything else that I want from here? Let's grab the sham chowder. Was that all the food she had? Yeah, it looks like it. I honestly, I don't have very many first aid kits. So let's go ahead and grab those. I can sell some of this stuff just for some extra dukes here. Um, I have the motorcycle, so I don't really need the wheel. I've got that ammo I don't need. I can sell some of those. Okay, I've got 300 dukes to my name. What does she have? Oh, Lucky Looter 2. Find more ammo and loot. That's not a huge deal. But I'd like to have the whole book. Um, I can sell the flashlight. I can sell that. Oh, gall. And it's not super important. Yeah, I'm sure I'll find... I'm sure I'll find another sometime, eventually. There's somebody outside. That's okay. Let's go through here, buy some of this food. And that leaves me with 78, and that's okay because I don't... I have some sugar butts at home. Who's gonna come say hi? Where are you? There you are. Uh, will you give me like a second to put some stuff on my bike quick? And put this on. Oh, thanks. What a lad. What a real pal. Okay. Let's go ahead and go back home. Because I have a little bit more work to do. So I actually got back to Bob. And I have a little bit of extra time. So I took a buried supplies quest from him. And let's see what's in here. Okay, the golden nut seed. Anything that kind of prevents me from having to spec into making the seeds would be fantastic. But it's not, like, a huge deal. Let's go ahead and just make sure our back is covered here. And we do a little bit of swiping. I am over-encumbered, though, so that is not something that I really want to have happening. Let's put these on my hotbar quick, just so I'm one less item encumbered here. And then let's drop that off as well. Anything else I can drop off real quick, just while he's... Oh, I got glass in my inventory. That's what I can get rid of. Let's give you a good stab. And then I've got a couple of people over here by my motorcycle. Oh, and there's a bunny over there too. But I don't really care too much about the rabbit. That is okay. My light is on. Oh, wow. Three shots with a knife on insane. That's <laughs> insane. <laughs> oh, and I'm getting... I didn't even... Uh, I didn't put my... Um, Nerdy glasses on, but that's okay. Let's go back and turn this quest in. I have so many buried supplies quests that are literally just like in the middle of a road, so hopefully I don't ever have to drive on these roads because I'm going to fall through them 100% guaranteed. And then I think, let's just run him over. I don't really care too much about him because I think I have to go this way. Oh yeah, I got to go all the way around. I don't really care too much about that chicken. Kind of want to just get home. And look at the base, see if there's anything else that I could change to it just before Horde Night starts tomorrow. So let's go ahead and make it over to, to Bob here and see what he's got for us. Um, I don't know how much time I will have for the night because I did just recently change the day-night cycle. And I don't really like doing it in the middle of the series, but... That's okay. We'll deal with it for now. Let's see. Uh, the Magnum ammo will sell for quite a bit. I have some vitamins at home already. So I think I'll buy that. And then I don't think I'll take any of these other quests because it is getting a little bit late. And I do think I need to mine a tiny bit of wood. And then also there's a couple other things that I need 
but I can't really remember them off the top of my head now. I should just harvest those trees. I don't think they'll give me the full 1,200. Um, wow, I got a lot of stuff. Oh boy, okay. Let me go ahead and uh, sort out my inventory here, put all the stuff back, and then I'll meet you in just a second. So I think since I have a tiny, tiny bit of time yet until night time, I do still need a little bit of iron, but I don't really want to go out and mine iron right now. So maybe I can find some stuff in here that I can get scrapped to iron. Oh, there's a guy in here. I bet I'll wake him up when I break this, eh? No. I'm really visible. Oh, yeah. No, nope, you're not gonna let me, uh, get the sneak damage on you, though, but... Nope. <laughs> <laughs> I'm always hopeful that that toilet is going to hold a gun for me, but I should really luck, uh, lucky goggle these, but I can't really be bothered with it. Not switching them around isn't the biggest deal in the world, but I can... Mm, I think I can break these bed frames, because I don't think a wrench gives anything for these little ones. Yeah, that gives a decent amount of iron. Do these shades give anything? Plastics. The couch gives leather, which I won't say no to, actually. I do need a little bit of it. It is starting to get a little bit closer tonight, but that is okay. I'm right next to my house, so if I need to run, then I can just do that real quick. But I just want to grab a little bit of iron. See if I can't get a little bit of forged iron to get a layer of iron spikes around the base. Because that would be fantastic if I could get that done. And if I can get it done done now, that means I don't have to worry about it. And I can do a little bit of Horde Knight. Or I can do a little bit of looting before the Horde Knight. I should really shut these doors behind me as well. Oh, I will put my lucky goggles for this though. There's an ammo pile. Search the nightstand. And then the big boy. Um, a lot of stuff I can scrap to parts, and then sell. And then of course we get... No. We don't get... We don't get the toilet pistol. I feel like I'm gonna need to get a toilet pistol at some point. Because once cops and demolishers start coming, I don't really know how I'm gonna handle those. But we'll get to there, theoretically. Let's see. I've got a little bit more stuff. Oh, more lockpicks. I will take more lockpicks. Was I in that house? So I wasn't in this one. Hello, lady. Oh, you're just gonna wake up while I'm standing still, huh? Excuse you. That's not very nice. Well, what's behind here, then? Oh, that's just iron, isn't it? I hate these, because you can never tell when they're gonna be iron or wood. I still have my lucky goggles on, and I killed her, but it's okay. XP being turned up, it's not a huge deal if I forget to put on the nerdy glasses, but still get a little bit irritated when I forget. I should really use my hunting knife to break those. Hello! There was already a stripper outside, so I highly doubt I'm going to get two people in here. Ammo pile? Uh, maybe there's some food in here, too. I did loot three sham chowders out of that one little bit. The... Um, buried supplies quest. So that was good. Gives me a little bit more food to hold me over here. And I'm definitely 100% not going to get a pistol in that. <laughs> Alright. But I think, um, I think I'm just going to finish this looting up here. And then I'll probably meet you back at home when I've gotten a little bit of iron to my name. And, uh, I'll meet you in just a second. Except there's a dog! Oh, no, and it's faster than I am. No! No, puppy! <sighs> the second I opened up that door, I saw a dog kennel. And I was like, oh, well, hopefully there's no dog in there. And sure enough, before I could even hit record to say, oh, I hope there's not a dog in there, a dog had went in there. And you know the sensible thing for me is instead of running away right away, I had to press record. Um, <laughs> let's just, uh, say no to finishing that place up. I already got the reinforced chest, so I'm sure that was the gist of all the loot that's going to be in there. I don't know how many toilet guns I missed out on by saying no, but I don't really feel like dropping below 40 health to a single 
zombie. So I'm just gonna go home. I'm gonna make, make maybe make some some nice drinks, some water, and calm down. We took on a lot today. I'm okay with just sitting here and relaxing and waiting for some forged iron to, to smelt. So I'm going to go ahead and end the episode off here. If you guys liked the video, feel free to leave a like down below. If you really enjoyed it, feel free to subscribe. Anyways, thanks everybody for popping by. Catch y'all next time.